honest today, and no disrespect to Tower Law, but it was an ideal game to come back to after, after last week's performance. But what was your thoughts? That was good. We just had a we had a chat with the lads prior, and uh, just said, look, we've got to get back to basics, get back to what was working for us early in the season. It's been a, a tough sort of sixty eight weeks, I would say, where we had probably haven't been on top of on top of one or two things. And uh, I thought we, we we deserved the win. Um, to be honest, we probably could have scored a couple of more goals, and nothing would have been said. But um, yeah, and brought apart all the strikers. Shared all the goals out. It's a good confidence booster for the strikers, isn't it? I'd say so. I'd say so. And we 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 said before the game we've got to put the ball in the box a lot more. Um, and we scored eight of the was it nine? We scored eight of the nine goals from across with the ball being put in the box. So um, they're taking on board what we're saying, and yeah, that's what we get. Some good performers today. Kieran got the man of the match award. And I mean, it's a difficult decision when we scored nine, but I personally thought David Vincent had his best game for us so far. Would you agree with that? Yeah, um, yeah I, would, I, would, I would say I, I thought he played really well, as, as did a lot of people in the team. And I think it's difficult when you're in games like this and the scoreline is that it's difficult. Who do, you, who do you give it to? Do you know what I mean? Do you give it to the, the lads who score goals or the lads who assist? I mean, John Wee has got five assi uh, four assists today, sorry, so he, he keeps telling me. Um, two with his right foot as well. Um, <laughs> So yeah, it's a, it's a tough one, but again, it's not about an individual, it's about a team. And I thought we, we went around um, everything today in a, in a professional manner and got what we deserved. You've got the feel for their keeper, haven't you? He made numerous crack and saves, still let nine in. It could have been any score without him, couldn't it? I think so. I, in, like you say, it, it's one of them. We probably had a, a, enough good chances to maybe score another nine, but then it's, it, yeah, it, it, we'll, take, we'll take the nine. So quick, how do you how do you choose the strike force for the next game when they've all done so well today? We'll, we'll sit down, we'll have a conversation, we'll figure out who we're playing against and have a look at what we can do and how we want to go about it and we'll we'll, we'll pick it from there. But yeah, they've they've done well. Ben Ray's done well when he's come on, Brad's had a chance when he's come on, and yeah, we've just gotta pick a team that we think is gonna win the game for us, as always. And just going back to last week, Craig, how long did it take you to get last sort of this performance out of your system? I'm not sure it is, to be honest. <laughs> Through mine, no, it, it's frustrating. It, that, that, that one last week was really frustrating for everyone, and everyone knows it. And probably a good game to come back into this one. Um, and well, like I say, put that one to bed. But like I say, we, we don't want too many more uh, Penrits um, this season. I'm going to wait to ask you, yeah, choose the night, no disrespect to them, but that's a good chance to keep this, this new run going, isn't it? We'll go back to when we first started the season and we fancy, we fancy ourselves against anybody. It's, it doesn't matter if the top, if the bottom, if the mid-table, whatever it is, but we've just got to go there, put on a professional performance, do what we're good at, and the result will take care of itself. Thanks a lot, Craig. No problem. Well done, the Cheers.